Florida has three species of rattlesnakes. The canebrake rattlesnake, or also called timber rattlesnake, the eastern diamondback rattlesnake, and the dusky pygmy rattlesnake. The dusky pygmy rattlesnake is the smallest of the three, but still a very, very interesting snake. Let's take a look at this snake in Florida. Detailed description. Most adult pygmy rattlesnakes are about 12 to 24 inches, 30 to 61 centimeters in total length, with a record length recorded of 31 inches, 79 centimeters. This is a very small snake, but it is thick for its size. The body color varies from light to dark gray and a lengthwise row of black or charcoal blotches disrupt a reddish brown stripe running down the middle of the back. Dark spots occur on the sides and line up with the dorsal blotches. The tail is slender and ends with a tiny rattle, which can barely be seen on most individuals. The belly is heavily mottled with black and white. The dorsal scales of the body are keeled. Each scale has a prominent raised edge. The head is distinct from the body and neck and has a black diagonal line just behind the eye. The pupil is vertically elliptical, cat-like, and there is a deep facial pit organ located between the nostril and the eye. The top of the head between the eyes is covered with nine large plate-like scales. The coloration of juveniles is the same as described for adults, except the tail tip of the juveniles is bright sulfur yellow in color. Range in Florida. Dusky pygmy rattlesnakes are found throughout Florida and in every county. They are not known to occur in the Florida Keys, but have been found on some barrier islands like St. Vincent in Franklin County. Diet and feeding behavior. Dusky pygmy rattlesnakes feed on a wide range of small prey, including centipedes and other insects. Frogs, snakes, lizards, and small mammals are also taken, with frogs and lizards probably being their main diet. These snakes may actively pursue prey by following their scent trails, but more typically, these snakes sit and wait to ambush prey. Juveniles have a bright sulfur yellow tail tip, which they raise and wiggle like a worm to lure prey within striking range. Reproduction. In Florida, females typically give birth to around 1 to 14 live young between July and August. Females remain with the young for several days, after which time they all disperse Competing males engage in combat dances when trailing females during the breeding season. Comparison with other species. Non-venomous hognose snakes in the species genus Heterodon are often confused with dusky pygmy rattlesnakes because they have similar patterns and live in similar habitats. However, hognose snakes have both an upturned nose and round pupils. They also lack both facial pits and rattles. Also similar is the North American racer or black racer in Florida. Non-venomous juvenile black racers are small and have a pattern of reddish-brown saddles down their backs on a gray background. Furthermore, they may strike and vibrate their tail tip to produce a buzzing sound in leaf litter. As such, these non-venomous snakes are commonly confused for pygmy rattlesnakes. However, juvenile black racers are pencil-thin have tiny heads 
with large eyes and round pupils and lack rattles on their tails. Habitat. Pygmy rattlesnakes are commonly found in habitats including lowland pine flatwoods, hydric hammocks, prairies, around lakes and ponds, and along borders of many freshwater marshes and cypress swamps. Possibly the habitat in which dusky pygmy rattlesnakes are most frequently encountered, at least in southern Florida, is along the banks of canals running through marshes and prairies. These species can be locally very abundant and it is often found in suburban neighborhoods where development encroaches into favorable habitats. These snakes can also be found in salt marshes. Defensive behavior. Pygmy rattlesnakes rely heavily on superb camouflage to avoid detection. When frightened, these snakes often remain motionless and expand their ribs so their bodies appear flattened against the ground. However, if provoked, they may attempt to escape or they may remain coiled and strike, shaking their tails, producing a faint buzzing sound that could easily be mistaken for a buzzing insect. But for the most part, these snakes make no sound at all. If further provoked, they may bob their heads and strike. However, these snakes are not aggressive and striking is only used in defense. Assessment of risk to people and pets. This snake is venomous. Bites are painful, but generally not considered life threatening to people or pets. However, bites can be more serious to children and small pets. As with all venomous snake bites, the victim should seek immediate medical care from a physician or hospital experienced in treating snake bites. Pygmy rattlesnakes are not aggressive and avoid direct contact with people and pets. Most bites occur when the snakes are intentionally molested or accidentally stepped on. This dusky pygmy rattlesnake was found in North Florida. Notice the pattern. It's a lot different than what you would see on most dusky pygmy rattlesnakes. This is called an aberrancy, where the pattern is different. Final comments. The dusky pygmy rattlesnake is the smallest species of venomous snake in Florida. Pygmy rattlesnakes are beneficial to people because they prey on many rodent species that are considered pests. Nevertheless, Many are unfortunately killed by people every year. I hope you found this video very informative and learn how to tell this snake from other snakes in Florida. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and stay tuned for more and more of these type of educational videos I'd like to produce.